Attention all Yorion Sky Nomad Copers, I am Zonko and today I'm going to teach you how to make custom watermarks on Magic Set Editor. Now this is assuming that you know how to install Magic Set Editor, so if you don't know how to do that, there are plenty of videos out there that I'll show you how. Now what a watermark is, is a little symbol on the back, so between this little line here, you can choose different watermarks <coughs> to like add under there. <coughs> So what if you want to make your own? Well, this is what the video is going to show you how to do. Now, we aren't going to be using the watermark links whatsoever. I have devised a much better plan. So what you need to do is find an image online. Let's say we want to make the combine overwatch symbol. It can be any image, but the more black and white it is, the better. So if you don't have an image like that, you can like edit it on some editing software. So we could put this in here. So combine PNG. I put in the stalker cards folder. Now you can see I already made some symbols of the uh, 10 of the stalker factions from the game. <clears throat> oh yeah, I made a previous recording of this, but I realized the uh, audio was off, so I had to redo it. <laughs> So next, you gotta go to the uh, Magic Set Editor resources to put actually open up the watermark. So this is the path. And this is how you get to it. So, it takes a little bit of digging, but once you get there, you have all these images that you can use. You get the vanilla ones, you got the ones that I got. So, I'm just going to delete this just to show what happens if you find a different size image. Now in order to make the images work, you got to like match their uh, file size. So this is like 160, this is 266, and this is 500. This is important when you go to the watermark names and watermarks. So we're going to open these with uh, just like notepad. Uh, I wouldn't use Microsoft Word, it doesn't work that way. So yeah, here are your two notepad f opens. Now let's say I want to make the combine symbol under the college symbols. You can like create a new choice for like your own set, but I found out that personally for me, I just like putting them under other ones. So as you can see, I already got my other watermarks there for another set. <clears throat> So I'm just going to name this choice combine and then under here, the watermarks, there is, it's a little bit more tricky. So what you got to do is copy this and you just paste it in and then you replace the uh, path name to whatever the image name that you're doing is. So for example, this is going to be combine. Now, if you couldn't tell when I got that uh, image, it was 1200 by 1200, not 500 by 500. So what you can do is just rescale it to the proper image size. Uh-oh, that's not what you do. So new, you set it to 500, and you make sure the background color is transparent. This is becoming a GIMP tutorial. <laughs> You drag your combine symbol in here and then you go to the rescale and I have this little lock in so that they both coincide when you press it and then you click your move tool get in there and make sure it matches up there we go then you export it I'm gonna have to blur out my name uh, you go to the desired folder that you got so for me it's stalker card symbols so I got the combine symbol here and I just replace it and I export now the combine symbol is the proper size so I just copy it I never drag anything is sometimes it doesn't actually copy it it's a little wonky so down here wait did I copy it copy paste there we go, combine symbol has showed up. 
Now as long as your image name is the same as your uh, watermarks image name, like right here, as well as the path and here, then you should be good to go. Now, the reason why I just copy this, the uh, college <clears throat> symbols have a uh, coded path to where they become like grayscaled and then they change color depending on the color of the magic card. So as you can see, there's like different options for all the other ones. So if you want to like put your symbol on the other parts, you just like copy paste, then rename the image. Now what you gotta do next is you gotta close Magic Set Editor because it won't save it until you uh, close it out. So now we're <laughs> ignore that. We're gonna we're gonna be going back in here. We're gonna be finding a good combine card to put it on. So let's just choose the Bridge Sentry. So between this little line here, if I can get it. Come on. There we go. You go to the college symbols because that's where I saved it. Then you go to combine and there you go, there's your watermark. Now I found it better that the watermarks shine more when they're like grayscaled. So as well as like they're a little more black and white and they got a little less gray in them. They just come out better. As you can see with the, the weed Batman, he is completely colored. And as you can see, you can still see his green and whatnot in there, and it's just really hard to see him. But on the other hand, like one of the stalker symbols that I went on GIMP and edited from color to just black and white. Let's just do duty. Yeah, see, it looks a lot better. So yeah, that's how you make the watermark. And if you like this video and you think you think this video helped you out, which I hope it did. Uh, you can like it, share it, subscribe, comment, do whatever you need. And thanks for sticking around, and I'll see you later.